they brewed it and they drank it and lay in a blessed swamp for days and days together in their dwellings and in in the dwelling sunder The rose of King and Scotland have fell into his foes. He smote their peaks in battle, he hunted them like crows. Over the miles of the red mountain, he hunted them, they fled, and threw them off his bullets of the dying. Summer came in the country, Redwood had the bell. But the man of the brewing was not alive to tell. In the grave it were all like children, on many mountain head. The Brewsters of the heaven lay numbered with the dead. The king of the red moon rode on a summer's day. And the bees sound to the curious, crying beside the way. The curious was angry, black was his brow and pale. To rule the land of heaven and let the heaven away. He touched with his vessels, riding through the heat. Came with a stone that was fallen, and the vermin hid beneath. The rudely plants from the hide. Now a word they spoke, a son of his aged father, last of the wolfish folk. The wolfish folk. The king set high on his charger, he looked on the little man. And the dwarf and swore he come, looked at the king again. Down by the shore he held him, and then the begin to bring your life from me for the secret of the dream. My dream. There stood the son of his father. He had a time long. And there were red rum. The sea rumbled below. And up and spoke the father. Shrill was his voice to hear. I have a word to cry with. A word for the royal royal. Life is due to the aged, and on a little thing, I would gladly sell the secret of the beats. To the king. His voice was small as a sparrow's and shrill and wonderful green. I would gladly sell my secret, only my son I fear. Life is a little matter, and death is not to the young. And I dare not sell my honor unto the eye of my son. Take him up in and bind him and cast. I have sworn to <clears throat> They took the sun and found him. Let him heal from the sun. And led to him and swallowed him and flung him far and strong. And the sea swallowed his body like that of a child of death. And beyond the cliff stood the father, last of the dwarfish men. True were the words I told you, only myself I feared. For I doubt that suckling courage that goes without a beard. But now, in this torture, for I shall never wait. Here dies in my bosom.